Going to the floating isles alone. Have you thought this through? None of you can go with me. It's a death wish to fight there without wings. Only I have the tech that proves useful in that terrain. But it's far too dangerous! You underestimate the might of the nether. You underestimate my power. Ah, we cannot risk losing you! And we can't risk letting them invade us. I'll take the fight to them before they take the fight to us. I like your valor, but it worries me sometimes. Don't die out there. My blades and wings are for mankind's liberty. I'll soar this alone because I must. I'll take our victory to the skies. Look, Ciara, you have to return this to the Bastion. The Piglin King is vengeful, and it won't be long before you're hunted down. No, no. I worked hard to take that. Let me keep it. I do not say this lightly. Do you have any idea what the Piglins could do when they're angry? I'm not returning the loot. It's the safest choice you have! It's either that or you get killed as soon as you walk out of here. It's not worth risking your life for riches you won't even be able to spend in your lifetime. I know what I'm doing. Don't be threatened. The Piglin King is one of the most powerful figures in the Nether. Rumors say he's under the protection of the Nether Princess. You don't know who you're crossing. I'm done. You're not some hardened thief who can slip away safe from consequences. You're not a one-man army, Ciara. Stealing from the Piglins is not necessary. There's a reason the Netherbane isn't fighting them. Please drop the axe, Ciara. Just admit you're in danger. 
Who are you talking to right now? Who is it? You see, I am one of the best assassins in the Netherbane, and I live up to my name. I could easily wipe out their species if I want to. I have my own reasons for doing this, but it's not something your cowardice can grasp. Now, let me clue you in. I am not in danger, Cain. I am the danger. You think I'm mere prey for the Piglin King? No. I am the one who hunts. Hide quickly. There's a ghost around the corner and it knows me. Stay inside, find a light. There's a monster in the darkness next to me. I yield. You have chosen death, treading into my territory. I only came here to save her. Let's forget this happened and we will go home. Your friend just murdered innocent piglins under my care. Ho <laughs> the irony! The princess who leads a warmongering race lectures me about killing innocents! Shut up! Are you not tired of this pointless violence among us? I have a proposal to end this all. A truce between my clan and the Nether Kingdom. I'm listening. Lance, the rogue Ender Mage. Not even the Nether Generals know about him, let alone his name. Why are you bringing this up? How do you know this? So naive, dear princess. I can't tell you that. You'll need my help in finding him. I... I'll just kill you right now. End this Netherbane nonsense. Kill me and you're going to leave a martyr. 
The Netherbane is an idea you cannot wipe out. Listen to me! What do you propose? Lance will invade the Nether Kingdom to redeem himself. Just let us go, and I will keep your crown safe. The Netherbane will avoid your domain, but I don't want any more pigs going to my tavern! So, you agree to my terms? Fine. This truce favors both of us. You know how to use your cards. I will play your game, but mind you, I'm only doing this for my kingdom. This is not for you. <laughs> Whatever floats you in the lava, princess. Meet me at the Netherbane Tavern. And lend me a horse, will ya? We ride to the Swamplands. Held down by the darkness Stuck in the in-between It feels like I'm haunted I don't know what's wrong with me I was calling out your name So far from home Drink the poison Close the door I've had enough I want no more Drink the poison Don't you know Things you said so long ago Drink the poison Your heart's alone Try to run You I guess this is where we part ways, Princess. Hold on. I need to talk to you about something. What is it? I... I've been having dreams for months. The Nether Star prophesied the coming of other demons like me. 
I had a dream about a feral demon, a kin of the Coven Witches. One who will be a threat to all dimensions if her power grows. Promise me, you will stop that beast. I'm not clear what you're talking about. No one like that exists. Are you afraid? Horrified. You have my empathy, but our deal is ended. I'm telling you about the future. Just be vigilant. Goodbye, Ken. Always speaking in riddles. Uh, wait! Uh, do I get to keep the horse? Hey, that's my stuff! Ow! <sighs> How am I gonna get home? Guess I'm walking. I should buy horses for the Netherbane Arsenal. Could expand our expeditions further. Stupid wither horses! What coven witch is she talking about? They're all extinct anyway. Some burning skeleton wiped them clean off the Mystic Forest. Uh, this is gonna be a long walk home. The Pinkins Fall started a civil war, tearing apart the unity of the Nether. The Pigmen shunned the others, and no good comes from this fighting but bloodshed of our own. What now, my lord? Good. Let them underestimate us. They know nothing of my ties with the Nether Princess. One shudders to imagine what power I can forge with another star, born from her death. The pigmen are yet to see our true power when we strike. When their tyranny falls, everyone shall bow to me as their new king, and I will restore the Nether back to its former glory. <laughs> There's a long road in front of you. There's a hard life behind you. There's a war being waged inside you. You got big footsteps to follow. You got a soul that's barely hollow. And that's a hard pill to swallow. Cause my life was spread It feels just like a curse and I'm always to blame Shivers down my spine when I say your name Since I was a kid you've been bigger than fame I'd like to see this cry that you put in my brain Early in my life I was put to the test I had to make some choices or forget about the rest And when I speak this fire you get nothing but the best Let me tell you something that you better not forget There's a long road in front of ya There's a hard life behind ya the war been waged inside ya You got big footsteps to follow You got a soul that's barely hollow And that's a hard pill to swallow They both went and you're ready to go What happened? How did everything turn so We can talk about it till I'm turning blue in the face I can laugh about it, joke about it, never the same I can't keep pretending it don't cause any pain It's a never ending cycle that you can't be tamed Early in my life I was put to the test I had to make some choices or forget about the rest And when I speak this fire you get nothing but the best Let me tell you something that you better not forget there's a long road in front of ya There's a hard life behind ya There's a war being waged inside ya You got big footsteps to follow You got a soul that's barely hollow And that's a hard pill to swallow
The Mystic Forest houses the Coven, a clan of witches with prowess for the mystic arts. We'll go there to purge his curse. You've heard of nothing from them since the Undead Reign. Therefore isolated, and the danger that awaits you are unknown. We have to take this risk. And save you again? What are you without a dragon, Dragon Tamer? Silence. You speak like zombies are an obstacle. But I alone have faced far more powerful foes than these walking corpses you speak of. <laughs> Relax. We're more than capable of putting up a fight. Don't worry about us, sire. Ah, your call. But this time, I won't be held responsible for whatever happens to you, Dragon Tamer. You better get back here safe. We will get back here safely. See you soon, sire. How many wounds is too much? How many scars will it take? How many battles can I survive yeah. before I am breaks? Take and you take and you take a little more. Now my own heart doesn't feel anymore. Searching, I'm searching, I'm searching along for something to cure my weather. and strong march toward the strongholds soon will the end be raised to a blazing ruin i only wish to protect the artifacts defeat is certain what do you intend this war is not ours to win hope lies not in the ashes of the end city but in our successor in the overworld the last ender watcher we only bide for time my queen one does not simply struggle against fate falter no matter what. I dare challenge this fate. We are all that stands against this mighty oppressor. If we are to meet our demise, then we shall do so as one. Together, we will fight valiantly to the last Enderman. Fear not death, but this destruction pending. Not my soul, the future I
Shouldn't we go back and help the poor Enderman? He wants to stall whoever's hunting us down. Then let's fight back. Hunter gets hunted. No, the Nether King will find us. That Enderman will die. And we don't want to die with him. The end is raised. He has nothing left to live for. His dying wish is for our safety. <gasps> That's so morbid. It's unlikely of you to back away from battle. What matters now is you and me. The fate of mankind lies with us. The End Dancer's noble sacrifice will not be in vain. Together, we will carry the torch of the Ender Watchers. Let it go, you should wait and see, cause you never know where you're gonna be. You should take it slow, let's not jump ahead, you could watch it grow.
Today is a day that we shall stand our ground and crush the savage horde in our doorsteps. As the end has now fallen to the nether, the fate of the world hangs in the balance. Scouts reported that the nether is unearthing an ancient portal in the far plains. The factions in the front lines fight with all they can. However, it's impossible to make it there in time as reinforcements, so prepare to fight against all odds. Then what's the point of saving this raised land? We can't. We have to contest that territory and cut off their mobility. Indeed. We have to slow down the invasion by any means necessary. Huh! This is insanity! Even the Ender Watchers couldn't defeat the mighty Nether Horde! You will send everyone to their deaths for a mere strategic point! Are you suggesting we sit out this fight? Thousands out there have died stopping this invasion while you complain about not wanting to die behind the safety of these walls. We are the last line of defense. It's now or never. There is no shame in fear. There's only shame in letting fear rule you! We are the Frostborn, proud vanguards of the overworld. In these dark times, we have to act as the last bastion of mankind. We fight not only to avenge the fallen, but for the survival and the future of our people.
Peace.